Utah, New Mexico State University. Animal and Range Science Department. Ah! Is feeding. The world. Follow us as we discuss some of the work that is being done at the community, regional, national, and international levels to further the goals of feeding the world in animal agriculture. Here at NMSU, we have a wonderful opportunity to take an active role in our community. Through Farm Tours with the Youth, we teach different groups about what happens on a university farm. These students get the chance to tour the on-campus farm where we house animals involved in various research projects and some of our commercial animals. The varying commercial uses of the different species are presented and covered, as well as the wide range of research being conducted within the department. Due to farm tours, the general public gains a better understanding of how NMSU helps feed the world. In addition to working with the public on campus, we work with producers in the field and in communities across the state. At the Corona Range and Livestock Research Center, we hold a monthly Ranchers Roundtable meeting. This offers a comfortable and casual forum for ranchers to ask questions that are pertinent to their operation. Out of all our attendees, 89% are beef producers and will travel on average 100 miles one way to attend this meeting. This is one area where NMSU directly contributes to the beef industry, in turn helping to feed the world. The graduate students and staff don't have to stray far from their daily activities to interact with undergraduate students. All animal and range science undergraduate students have the opportunity to apply the knowledge they have acquired throughout their studies in the department. We hold an academic quadrathlon to determine which group will represent us at the ASAS Western Section competition. By encouraging students to have a full understanding not only in the classroom, but in a practical setting, we are turning out young professionals who will fit easily into their chosen fields. Many of these are involved with feeding the world either through animal, crop, or natural resource management. NMSU is also conducting research at a regional level. Using targeted grazing, we are evaluating integrative management techniques that will incorporate livestock production, suppress catastrophic wildfire, and improve wildlife habitat. Low moisture block, protein supplement, and low stress herding are used to encourage cattle to graze underutilized areas of large pastures. This will also provide livestock producers with viable alternative management techniques, aiding in improving range resources while increasing utilization of available forage resource. We are also involved in educating regional communities and cultures. Instructors from Diné Community College, located on the Navajo Reservation, met with our faculty and graduate students to learn about sheep reproduction, nutrition, health, and management. Because sheep are a way of life for the Navajo people, the instructors will utilize the information gained from NMSU to pass on to their community. Through NMSU research and educating communities in the region, we are making a difference in animal agriculture and feeding the world. NMSU hosts an annual bull sale where approximately 40 bulls are sold. Due to NMSU hosting this annual bull sale, we help supply quality bulls throughout the nation, further benefiting animal agriculture. NMSU is currently working with the National Alliance for Advanced Biofuels and Bioproducts. The oil and algae is used to create alternative fuel and the co-product is being analyzed for suitability as an animal feed. NMSU nationally collaborates with universities to enhance research. We are working with North Dakota State University researching angiogenic factors and how they can increase fetal survival during early pregnancy. This then can lead to higher production rates and ultimately feed more people. Several graduate students and professors are researching overseas to improve animal genetics, grazing distribution, and agricultural rangeland ecosystems. PhD candidate Casey Diatley is currently in Australia to identify genes involved in the onset of female puberty in Brangus cattle. This will increase reproductive efficiency and the availability of affordable beef around the world. MS candidate student Vanessa Prilson deploy GPS collars and sheep and cattle in Argentina to improve sustainability of meat production on rangelands. Dr. Derek Bailey worked with the Qinghai Academy of Animal and Veterinary Science in China on developing tools to improve the distribution of yaks and monitoring forage quality and quantity. Our international contributions illustrate how the NMSU Animal and Range Science Department is helping to feed the world through disciplines in animal agriculture.